Ford Focus R's Mountain VS Mercedes AMG A45. Mountain Kit aims to give the fast Ford Focus R's an edge over the hot Mercedes AMG A45. Forget hot hatchbacks. If you want the fastest, most powerful family 5 door, the game has moved on you'll need to look towards the realm of the hyper hatch. Both our test contenders pack an almighty punch. In the blue corner we have the Ford Focus R's, fitted with the Ford Performance by Mountain FPM 375 kit, upping power from 345 bhp to 370 bhp for not much cash. It faces the Mercedes AMG A45. Under its bonnet is the world's most powerful production four-cylinder turbo engine, a 376 bhp 2.0 liter. However, the A45 costs 9,166 pounds more than the Focus. Is the Mercedes worth the extra for the marginal power gain? Or can the people's champion pull off yet another victory? Head to head. Model. Ford Focus R's Mountain FPM 375. Mercedes AMG A45 4 MATIC. Price. 32,664 pounds. 41,830 pounds. Engine. 2.3 liter 4 CYL turbo. 2.0 liter 4 CYL turbo. Power slash torque. 370 bhp slash 510 nm. 376 bhp slash 475 nm. Transmission. 6 speed manual, 4 wheel drive. 7 speed dual clutch automatic, 4 wheel drive. 0 to 60 miles per hour. 4.9 seconds 4.3 seconds top speed 166 miles per hour 155 mpg test economy 22.8 mpg 19.9 mpg co2 slash tax 175 g slash km slash pound 210 162g slash km slash pound 185. Options. Metallic paint, 745 pounds, luxury pack, 1000 pounds, 19 inch forged alloy wheels, 975 pounds, R's Recaro bucket seats, 1145 pounds, door edge protectors, 85 pounds, painted brake calipers, 100 pounds. Designio Special Metallic Paint, 1,795 pounds, AMG Dynamic Plus Package, 1,395 pounds, AMG Night Package, 1,595 pounds, AMG Performance Exhaust, 510 pounds, Premium Package. Ford Focus R's Mountain. 4. Value for Money, Trick 4-Wheel Drive Tech. FPM 375 kit a cost-effective upgrade. Against, even new Sync 3 infotainment trails limited boot space, driving position. Ford's Focus R stole the headlines when we first tested it back at the start of 2016, and a year on the R's has been treated to a boost in power courtesy of the 899 pounds Ford performance by Mountain FPM 375 kit. As with the Mountune modifications to the Fiesta ST and Focus ST, the upgrades include a new free-flowing air filter and a bespoke ECU map, as well as a new recirculation valve. Combined, these take power from 345 bhp to 370 bhp. Apart from this, the mechanical makeup is the same, but that's no bad thing, because the Arza's chassis boasts more than enough grip to contain the extra power. Alongside the Cosworth developed 2.3-liter four-cylinder turbo units 370 bhp, there's 510 nm of torque on overboost, which really starts hitting at just over 2,000 rpm. There's a soft edge to the throttle response as the turbo gets up to speed, but once it's boosting, the performance is savage. The difference is difficult to notice in any one area as the upgrades have been so well calibrated, but our in-gear performance figures show it's a match for the Mercedes, 
accelerating between 50 and 70 miles per hour in sixth in 5.3 seconds. Unfortunately, due to drizzly conditions during our test runs, the Rs only managed to sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.9 seconds, Ford claims an official time of 4.5 seconds for the upgraded car. But there's no doubt launch control and the four-wheel drive system helped. Developed by British firm GKN, it's a clever unit that can send up to 70% of the engine's torque to the rear axle, where the rear diff can then divert all of this to just one wheel. The Rs has four driving modes, normal, sport, track and drift, the car's party piece. Normal is as you'd expect. Sport sharpens throttle response and initiates some tight, rally car style cracks and pops from the exhaust when you change gear or lift off. Track and drift are best used away from the public road, so Ford says, with the latter adding a greater rear bias to the four-wheel drive system. Squeeze the throttle before the apex of a bend in second gear and you can feel the R's shift drive to the outside rear wheel as the tail arcs round, tightening the car's line. While it adds adjustability, it sometimes feels like the focus is fighting itself. Even so, it's a clever trick for a front-engined hatch. Some people might be put off by the Arza's styling, but with its big wing and body kit it leaves you in no doubt about its performance potential. Inside, material quality is similar to a standard Focus, so it's robust rather than tactile but the A-Class's cabin is no oil painting given its price, either. Testers notes. Technology, infotainment can't match rivals, whether it's our Ford Sync 2 or the Sync 3 in new orders. Steering, normal, sport, track and drift modes adjust the weight of the steering and throttle sensitivity. Materials, despite its loud exterior styling, inside the R's features the same rather basic but durable material quality as a standard Ford Focus. Mercedes AMG A45. 4. Blisteringly quick, huge grip, gearbox balances performance and ease of use. Against, exhaust drones on overrun, interior feel and quality, fuel consumption. Power and speed were never problems in the previous version of Mercedes AMG's performance hatch, but a hike in engine output from 355 bhp to 376 bhp for this revised A45 model means it's got even faster. However, Coaxing more power than a Porsche 911 delivers from a 2.0-liter four-cylinder turbo does equate to some lag. The A45S motor stirs at around 1,750 rpm and only really wakes up as the rev needle sweeps through to 2,000 rpm. By 2,250 rpm, where the full 475 nm of torque hits, the A-Class's engine feels rampant. This shove is sustained to 5,000 rpm, with peak power coming in 1,000 rpm later. Compared with the Focus's flatter feeling top end, the A45S unit rushes to the red line with a keenness that's unusual for a turbocharged engine. Select race mode, pull the right shift paddle, and with the 510 pounds AMG performance exhaust switched on, the A45 emits an almighty bang as it moves up through the gears. The shifts are quick on the way up, but coming down the gears the ECU slow throttle blip can make the changes feel labored. Plus, that loud exhaust gives a booming drone on the overrun dot however, it offers plenty of theater with launch control engaged, as the AMG sounds like a rally car sat against its rev limiter. Lift off the brake and the A45 will punch its way from 0 to 60 miles per hour in an impressive 4.3 seconds, as our test figures show. As with the Focus, our performance testing was conducted in less than optimum weather conditions, we'd expect both cars to be closer to their official times in the dry, Mercedes claims 0 to 62 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds. One option we definitely choose is the 1,395 pounds AMG Dynamic Plus package. While it seems expensive, the adaptive suspension dampers make the car much more usable every day. Like the Focus, the A-Class borders on being too firm for most UK surfaces in the sportier setting, 
while the balance between body control and ride comfort is better for road use in the softer mode. However, it still thumps over some bumps, and the speed-sensitive steering doesn't offer as much feedback as the Ford's purer, fixed-ratio setup. The occasionally crashy damping impacts ride quality a little, although the bucket seats do offer lots of support and decent comfort. In other respects, the A45 is more usable than the R's, as its larger boot, easier maneuverability, and better driving position combine to make it more flexible. You just expect better interior quality for the price, with an outdated center console design and some questionable materials. Tester's Notes Drive, dual clutch gearbox gives a performance edge on the Ford, and bucket seats add comfort. Technology, Mercedes 8-inch screen isn't touch sensitive and quality of the graphics could be better, but CarPlay and Android Auto are included. Design, ergonomics and dash design fall behind rivals, but boot space adds some practicality. Verdict First place, Ford Focus R's Mountain. The Mountain equipped R's nearly matches the punch of the A45, but costs a lot less. Although it isn't as practical, that's not so important with hatchbacks like these. The Focus is more engaging, with as much grip as the AMG but more adjustability. That it's so much cheaper seals the Mercedes fate. Second place, Mercedes AMG A45. There's no doubting the A45's ballistic pace, but this comes at a price. The extra outlay over the Focus is difficult to justify given the quality of the A-Class's interior. While it's more practical, it's more expensive to run. However, the A45 just isn't as engaging or as adjustable as the Ford.